Paul Rolfe, if I could tell you one thing, what would it be? Stephen Brown, if I could tell you one thing, it would be a miracle. There's many things to say. There's no magic bullet, is there, in this business that you can fire? Um, so I had many things in my mind. You asked me this question the other day. But I was thinking about uh, empathy and listening skills with, with a potential new client. When you go to that valuation, when you walk in the door of a new property, most agents are looking around. What can they see? Oh, my goodness, they've got a lime green wall in in the lounge. Uh, they're looking at the property, trying to work out if it's what it's worth. They're listening to the customer, but not really listening, not always. I mean, some people have got this skill. Some haven't, to be fair. It's about engaging. It's about really listening to what they want and asking some questions about what it means to, to move. Because I think everyone has a fear of failure to do big things in, in this life including being an agent, in fact, walking in the valuation. Will I not get it? Will I get it? Is that a bit of fear sometimes to go the extra step to ask the right questions or to be out on a limb to ask something unusual? Uh, I once had a, a young agent say to me, I went to this customer and a woman told me her husband just died the other week. And he phoned me up to say, could or should he send some flowers to this lady? I said, yes, of course you should. You need to engage with this person, show empathy. And he did that, and he got the listing, and he was most surprised. So be empathetic with people. Don't just say yes and no at the right time. Really listen and understand and ask back what everything means to them, why it's so important to move, not just like, yeah, we want to move because of my job, et cetera, et cetera. So that's oh, yeah. what I would say. That's the one thing I would say to you today.